Hey guys, this is Scott Leroy, Scott Leroy Marketing, coming out for a weekly update. And today's update is actually on the new birthday smart plan. So if you look up here over inside the product updates, new smart plan alert, check out the new birthday smart plan. All right, so if you're ever adding inside a smart plan, there are two ways to do it, all right? Number one is to go through the contacts. All right, so I can actually click on the contact on here and I could come over and for instance, I'll go to myself to make it a little bit simpler. All right, and then as long as they have a birthday added in, you can actually add this. So I don't have a birthday on here. So to do that real quick, I'm just going to click on the little pencil icon. I'm going to go to add more information, go to about on here, and then I'll add inside the birthday. And you guys get to see when I'm actually born. <laughs> there you go. December 21st, 19, there it is, 88. All right, so I'll click the save button real quick. All right, voila. All right, so now we've got our birthday added in on here. All right, so one of the easiest ways is literally go through, you can click on Add Smart Plan up here, or you can click on Smart Plans over here on the right-hand side and click the Add to Smart Plan option. This will then bring up all seven different Smart Plan options you currently have available. All right, and then I could literally just click on Add to Smart Plan for the birthday on here, and I'm done. All right, so it's that simple. So as you can see, date added, date last executed. All right, but I'm going to remove that real quick. All right, because the other way to add inside a Smart Plan is also over here, all right, if you notice, you have your Smart Plan option. All right, so I'm going to click on Smart Plans real quick on the left-hand side. All right, now this will always pop up for the time being. Very soon, once they officially launch it, you'll actually be able to see all the different options where you can actually create your own custom Smart Plans, and it'll have a little kind of overview on here, too. But right now, you'll just want to click on the Start Using Smart Plans Now option. All right, and then it's going to walk you through all of your information. So hopefully you've already set up your marketing profile. So I'll click Get Started on here. All right, so my marketing profile is already set up. We're good to go on the branded header, about, social media, legal footer. All right, so everything looks perfect on here. Good to go. I'll click on Next for about. We are good to go on here too. All right, I can click on the Market Center name. Change that to Little Rock. All right, we got our social media info set up, our app link. Legal footers added in. All right, I've configured my email. If you happen to have Twilio, you can add that in as well for this too. I'll click continue on here for the smart plans. Then this is where we can actually choose the different smart plans. So once again, this will give you kind of an overview of all seven smart plans that are currently available for you. Now the main one we're going to focus on here is going to be the birthday one. And as you can see, there are six steps, six durations, and you can actually view the steps on here too. All right, so the first one we're going to have is a reminder to send a handwritten birthday note. All right, so just to give you a heads up, so instead of it just being like a typical email that you probably had on your email campaigns before, this will be a little bit more um, personal, basically. All right, then there's a delay of four days, then a phone call. It's a reminder to call contact for their birthday. One day delay, reminder to send birthday, social post or email on here, and then an SMS happy birthday text message too. So in theory, you're going to be hitting them four different times with a birthday note. All right, a call, an email, or a social post, and then even a text. All right, so I'm going to click Add Contacts. And then anyone that currently has a birthday on here, it looks like I have a couple more birthdays than I anticipated, we can click Select All, and it'll automatically add them over. So I can click Add to Smart Plan on here. And voila, four contacts were added to the Smart Plan queue. All right, now this will automatically notify us. So I'm going to go ahead and click the Next button on here. There we go, so here's our Smart Plan. All right, click continue on here, and we're done. All right, so it's that simple, so I can X out of this now. And whenever that actually comes up for their birthday, we'll have the different task up here as well as different reminders for us to utilize. So there you go. So that is your KDB command tip for the day.